you're like, why didn't I do that before? <laughs> I have teeny tiny matches, so if it takes a minute, don't get mad, okay? <laughs> Never mind. You guys know what the phoenix does after he burns? He rises. Anybody know about phoenixes? He rises. <laughs> he rises. So we're going to send our summers all the way up to heaven. And they'll stay there for you whenever you want. You can go up to heaven and you can visit your summer again. Just in case, you know, you get lonely or <laughs> reminiscent. Or you miss it a little bit. Because nothing's ever gone forever. Even things that burn transform into ash. Right? Trying to get you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, someone's trying to escape. <laughs> it's tricky. I don't have shoes on or I get it. I should get it without my shoes. <laughs> You guys can keep the fire with you of the summer and the phoenix, right? Keep the fire part. That's the good part. And as summer closes down, I know the first thing everyone thinks about is what? Halloween, right? <laughs> That's what I think about. <laughs> But as we start going into fall, we start going into the earth. And all the fire that was summer starts to kind of come down and we get into earth energy. So my friend Chastity Raina has been nice enough to offer us a very special meditation that she's been getting that's going to help us go into the earth. So we're going to have her come up here. Yay, Chastity! Yay. maybe a little bit more than Maj did. <laughs> Do it. Um, this is a guided meditation that I was given in Lodge last weekend to receive the blessings from the earth. And given that this holiday is about going down into the earth, uh, I thought it would be... No, actually. Can everybody hear me? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. okay. No. no, you can't? Okay. So what I would like, if everybody is down to participate, is for everybody to stand up create enough space for you to actually like raise your arms, open your hearts, be ready to receive. Um, I would also like for all digital media to go away.